this is Samantha here from RecipeThis.com and also the voice behind the popular Kitchen Gadgets podcast, Magic with Gadgets. Today I wanted to show you how to cook an air fryer roast duck. Because the duck is a little bit on the large size the ones we use, we always cook it in the air fry oven. It can then rotate and it's the most delicious air fry duck you've ever tried. Even better, you can slice it up, cook it and serve it however you like. Reserve some of the fat for duck fat potatoes and just enjoy. And we also have 450 plus more easy air fry recipes over at RecipeThis.com as well as a fantastic air fryer mini course which is free and our free air fry newsletter. I recommend you check it out and if you have any questions or comments you can reach out to us or just comment on this video. So this is the roast duck that we are cooking in the air fry oven on the rotisserie. My concern is that from when we originally did the recipe that's on RecipeThis.com is that this duck is slightly bigger and I think this is a big problem for many of you when you're cooking air fryer recipes is that when you're roasting a meat your size is often different to the recipe you're following or sometimes it's a different air fryer so I just want to compare and see how this does in comparison so the lovely Dominic is Tying up the legs, it's important you tie up the legs when you're doing your ducks or your chickens in the air fryer so that it rotates properly and it doesn't get stuck. And what is fantastic about doing duck is that because it's, it's on the rotisserie, it rotates evenly and you get a fantastic all-round cook. Now, the concern is, is if the rotisserie is going to actually properly fit because this duck is bigger than the last one we did. So we're just checking to see if it's going to work or not. Oh, we've got through the other end, so we should be good. So we've assessed it and this duck is a little on the large side for the air fry oven. So Dominic's um, tucked it in a bit and now what he's doing is he's going to chop off the wings because the wings is what's going to stop it from rotating. So by losing the wings we can make it perfect and make it ideal. You can always cook the wings later in your air fryer. Or we've got a dog wandering around and she's saying, I'll have them. And there you go. We've lost the excess and now it's okay size to get in the air fryer oven. And now let's season it. We recommend a good bit of salt and pepper on your duck because that's all it really needs because duck is so flavoursome on its own. It doesn't really need a lot of extras. Um, we have done it, uh, the duck, both with extra virgin olive oil and without. The duck is quite fatty, so it doesn't really need it, but the extra virgin olive oil can be like a sticky substance that helps the salt and pepper stick to it and makes it more flavoursome. So it's up to you which way you want to go. So now Dominic's going to attach it and get it going so that we can have our rotating roast duck. As you can see, it's taking up a lot of room in the air fryer oven and I'm sure you can understand now why we needed to lose the wings. So if you can see, there's really not much space going on in there. So if you're doing the same with chickens, uh, make sure you go for a small one because the bigger ones just won't rotate. Right, let's close the door and get it started, shall we? We're going with 180 Celsius, 360 Fahrenheit. And we're going with a cook time of an hour. You have to be quick with this machine because if you just pause it for a minute, it starts going on its own. And there we go. Let's wait for it to beep and let's switch on the rotisserie. So now the rotisserie is switched on. I can see that it's rotating because I was concerned it might be too big, but it's spot on. So let's talk the duck fat. 
this is what's left from just one minute of cook time and this is what we have generated from the 59 minutes of cook time. Now what's brilliant about this is that you can drain it and then you can use it to make air fryer duck fat potatoes which we will be showing you in another video. So if you want to check out our YouTube channel we have an air fryer duck fat potatoes recipe which kind of follows on from this story of how to use the duck fat. But whether you use it or not, do make sure you drain the drip pan because otherwise it will make a lot of mess. So we've allowed the duck to rest for five minutes. We've removed the skewers and as a really nice treat, we now have air fry rub and roast beef going on in our kitchen. So check out our YouTube videos for that one. And now, as you can see, the duck is lovely and crispy. And Dominic's going to cut into the breast just to see if it's cooked. Always cut into the thickest part of the breast because that's the bit that takes the longest to cook. I think this bit always makes you a little bit nervous because you don't know whether it's cooked or not. And as you can see, that's perfectly cooked air fried up breast that we've just chopped that Dominic's just chopped off for us there. And our our lovely um, boxer girl is hiding under the table waiting for her cut. She seems to think she's getting that full breast to herself. I keep trying to explain to her that a duck breast is really, really small, so it's not going to uh, be enough for her. But we'll see. I cannot wait to tuck into this and tell you what I think of it. It looks beautiful. It just reminds me of when you have duck at the Chinese. So if you want to go Chinese, you can season your duck with Chinese seasonings instead and kind of do your own version of crispy duck and pancakes at home. So Dominic has been so kind as to slice up my duck breast for me from our whole duck and of course while the air fryer oven was busy cooking roast duck our Philips air fryer XL was busy cooking duck fat potatoes and it's just fantastic for one of those great easy meals. If there's just two of you and you want something really nice for dinner, then you can do, do a whole duck and then you can do some potatoes to go with it and it's just fantastic. And you know, they're just so amazing is the duck. It is just so soft and tender when you use the rotisserie. I'm amazed by the difference between using the rotisserie in the air fryer compared to just cooking meat in the air fryer basket. People often ask me what the difference is uh, between the air fry oven and the air fry basket and I would say the air fry basket is amazing for everything but the air fry oven wins on the rotisserie so if you're worried that rotisserie isn't for you then follow this recipe and just see how lovely and tender the duck is Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the Recipe This family. You can find us on Twitter, Facebook and Pinterest. We also have a weekly newsletter at recipethis.com forward slash newsletter where we share with you our latest kitchen gadget recipes, what we're cooking in the Milner kitchen and so much more. As well as this, we recommend that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and then whenever we have a new video, you will be the first to know. And if you want to know about all our future videos, then I recommend you hit the bell for instant notifications. But even better, we now have a podcast. It's called Magic with Gadgets. Simply search Magic with Gadgets on your favourite podcast player and you'll find us there.